Oh my god! A pool in your living room. I love that it's just open. I've never seen a home like this before. What did you see? The beach. I the did. The view that she was. Yeah. What's good, y'all? This is the Machette's React, and we're back with another video. Who we got today, C? Today, we are back with another American Reaction. Super excited about this video, yes. guys. If you're new to us and, and we're we new, new to you, you, make sure you scroll down, hit, hit that, that subscribe, subscribe button, button, and turn on the post notification bell, because we're, we're on the road to 100K. And we cannot get there without you guys, all right? Join the family. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Hi. It's Naomi Campbell, and welcome oh, to Oh, she's home. actually showing us her Follow home. Me. Yes. You know, I thought somebody's going to be just showing, like, an advertisement of her home, but she no. actually gets to show it herself. Right. Wow. It looks like a resort. Yeah, it does. So we are in Melindi, Kenya. I came to Melindi in 1994 for the very first time, and then fell in love with Melindi in 1999. Everything is under a Makuti roof, so everything is open. So we mm. will call this area the living room. And so what we do here is mostly we gather here before dinner and Hold up, wait a we minute. just talk. My living, room, my, my living room never had a pool, better yet, uh, just a fish tank. Oh, my God. A pool in your living room? I love that it's just open. I've never seen a home like this before. What, did you see the beach? I the did. The view that she was, yeah. I did. Yeah, she definitely built this with her own, like, this is what she wanted. Yeah. You can tell she got what she wanted. Okay, and we also gather here after dinner. Most of the furniture is workmanship that's been done here in Kenya. So we keep it local. This table is one piece, also done here in Kenya. This is a chandelier that we got in Different. 2000. It has that Moroccan Egyptian vibe. And mm. we have to give props to the two ladies, which is Carol Beckwith and Angela Fisher, who has been champion Africa and Kenya for so long. So these two ladies for me are my heroes of the whole region because they've just done and always loved and just shown the beauty of Kenya. This wow. is one of four pools. This is the coldest pool in the house. It's because it can get very hot here. So this is the cold pool. We put dinner tables four here, pools, depending on how many people. We can have three or four different tables, but we just need one big oval table here. The and dining room is outside. It's all, <laughs> with lanterns, it's all candle lights. It's very sweet. And what I love about being here is that you're really living outside. You know, even if you're covered, you're getting that you're still sun. Open. You, know, mm -hmm. you still get the natural air and the breeze and just part of the whole landscape green and i feel like this is what people want right now is just to be outside all the time and beautiful climate of course this used to be one of my rooms do you want to see i love this room it's got a great energy oh the ceilings it's all gotten wooden beams that's what we wanted because it's just i think wood is so grounding i love the wood that goes around I just love this room. It's just chilled. We have air conditioning. I don't personally sleep in air conditioning. I don't like it. It gives wrinkles, I believe. So we have these nets. And I love this old-fashioned net. I love it. I always love when I go to hotels and they have it. I mean, of course we have mosquitoes here. We want you to feel where you are. I wouldn't want to have a place that's like takes away from the feeling. We have the best of both. I think she, she, she nailed it. She said, I want you to feel where you are. Right. And it's definitely giving that vibe. Right. Although it's luxury, you know, you still see a lot of the culture. I love that she said that everything in her home is local. Yeah. She's yeah. supporting the economy. Facts. Love that. Yep. Where on the beach we have it a little more modern, but here it is authentic Kenyan African art artifacts. So I'm going to take you upstairs. So upstairs is like just a chill area. So you can have a lot of people staying with you, and you just never feel like it is because everyone just does their own thing and has their own little it corners definitely gives that they that like. Energy. I used to yeah. love to come up here to read. So this is our gaming area. We used to play cards up here a lot too. Chess. Again, we have a lot of this African textiles and artifacts, which I love all this stuff, love. Here I love to come 
Sometimes I would do yoga here because I just like overlooking property. It's quite sunny here. Shall we go down? This is breakfast area. Buffet comes here and everyone just eats. This area has always been a buffet. This is a resort. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, you can tell she hosts a lot of people here. Mm -hmm. Like she is, it looks like a home, but it, it looks like a family home. It's so open to the public. Right. Yeah, it is. Like right. open areas. You Love can't it. go wrong with this one. It's like yes. she thought of people when mm -hmm. she built this. She didn't think that I'm going to have this to myself. She said, this right. is going to be open. Right. When I read the title, I thought it was going to be like a little small beach house. Mm -hmm. This is a whole resort. She it said is. one of four pools. Right. We only see one bedroom. Right. So <laughs> far. Bay area. Once again, we're under a Makuti roof. This table is also done here. It's one piece. This is a table when we do like buffet lunch. Everything's laid out on this table and everyone just comes and eats. This is our local artist, Armando Tanzini, who I would love for you to meet. But what I love about Armando is he also has a school where he teaches the local artists and mentors them. And I love that. I don't know. People have such like the wrong perception of Africa. It's a beautiful place. This is definitely my go-to place of like chilling, relaxing, like completely shutting down. This is the place where I shut down. Mm -hmm. Kenya is just like a natural gem. It has the safari, it has the bush, it has the coast, it has the dunes. It has all the elements. And people don't realize that. I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm on the Indian Ocean. Love the Atlantic, but Indian's better. <laughs> <laughs> This is the main pool area where everyone gets sun. I wouldn't say this is a jacuzzi because you don't want heat in Kenya, but this is kind of like just a smaller pool with a little fountain. All right, no. And you can just sit it's and chill mm -hmm. and have a mocktail in my case and relax. It is real okay, beautiful. Okay, here we go. So this is another area. We call it new houses, which has four rooms each and a kitchenette. What I love about Kenya is you've got bougainvilles growing wild everywhere, and I love bougainvilles. Come on in. Each room has its own little twist. None of the rooms are identically the same. Basically, it's just nice. Everyone has their own area. They can do what they want. It can be very independent here. You can be together, and then you can have your alone time, and nobody bothers anyone. It's like you never That's know someone like else is there. I right. love these. I just oh, love these. These are my favorites. You will sleep on my that. My favorites. The Definitely. first time I heard about Kenya was from my mother's elder sister, my auntie June. And then the second time I heard about Kenya was from Lauren Hutton, who always said to me when she would go to Kenya to revitalize after working. I mean, Lauren Hutton is Lauren Hutton, legendary. She always said I would come back with a real smile. And I remember the first time I was coming to Kenya and I said to Lauren, I'm going to Kenya, she said to me, what look at your smile when you get back from Kenya? You're gonna have a real smile, and I so is that true? Well, because we have you know reacted to a lot of well, not a lot, but a couple of you know tribes and the dances and things like that, and the people seem happy. They do authentically. Yeah, a hundred percent. They do. Yes, yeah, sir. How true is that? Good. Yeah, drop that in the comment right. section. Hundred percent right. Taking you to the spa. We like Henry yes. Cheneau's spa. spa. Every girl wants a spa. We love with Henry Cheneau, so he thought it would be great to have Henry Cheneau put in a little spa in, in the house. So this is the spa. This is the room where we do one of the Cheneau techniques. This is hydrotherapy. You get in like the bath for like 30 minutes. And then after they wrap you with mud, they cover you with mud and they sink you in this one. And you sink down, 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 down. But your skin, good detox. Oh, we gotta do that. Detoxing, mm -hmm. Cleaning out all the toxins. And that's what you wanna do when you go away and chill. I recommend all my friends when they come here and all my guests to do this on the first day so that they have the best sleep ever the first night. Especially after a road trip. Mm -hmm. So I've never showed you my room. That's the only place I haven't showed you is my room, come. Let's see. This is my room. Come in. So it's my little living area. This is my bed area. And I love this picture. Oh, the Maasai tribe. Body. 
I think he's gorgeous. Beautiful. I love his face. I love his eyes. I love everything nice about him. Too, I can well. reach out and touch him. This is a great picture. That's another one that's good. The lion. Well. I mean, the lion is it. The yep. lion and the panthers. I love panthers too. That's a piece from Armando. I mean, even my door. Everything is done here. Everything is done here. It's beautiful. The headboards. Everything is done in Kenya. They're so good at woodwork. So besides the pool, we also have the beach across the street. It's just a chilled area on the Indian Ocean. It's just really, it's beautiful. It's a little paradise. You love that Maldivian water? We have it here. That transparent blue right here. It's nice, man. Mm -hmm. So we are back to where we started. Thank you so much, AD, for coming and joining me for a little trip around my home here in Melindi, Kenya. And I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you will all now look at Kenya with different eyes Definitely. and come here and enjoy the gorgeous nature that it gives. Thank you so much. Brown girl out. Definitely love wow. it. Wow, wow. I love it because this is a part of africa that we don't see now check me out when i hear you when i say this y'all i've seen homes with massive windows mm -hmm. tall glass see-through yeah. like you can see all into the house but i've never seen a home where it's just completely like open just like just open like yeah me either she me didn't either. have no windows no she did bro i it, let me y'all correct me if i'm wrong y'all watch this video to the end with us man let me know did she have yeah. any windows in her house no. i didn't see any windows if it was um, open, it was open. No right. glass. She said strictly wood. I like it. That's a, that's a, I like that's it. Right. It was a nice resort. <laughs> it was a resort. <laughs> okay, so, like, with her just stressing that a lot of people don't, they have the a wrong idea of Africa. They, yeah, some people you know? do. Yep. And that's why we like showing Africa and other cultures and countries so much. F because facts, a lot of people facts. just don't know about Africa or mm -hmm. other countries. Back you know? to our school system, it's like, it's not taught. You know what I'm saying? If you see it in the book, you really got to, like, read a book or find the right one. Right. They express what they have out there in Africa. Right. So, seeing what you see on our channel is as real as it's going to get, you feel me? Mm -hmm. So, man, it's, it's beautiful. It's right. beautiful. All right. So, let's continue to share it together, learn together, explore the world together. We have big things coming soon in 2023. Big things coming. <laughs> so we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like this video, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell. We have enabled our super, super thanks. thanks if you like to support the channel that way. As well as our joint features to become a VIP member of the channel. Check it out. Send in your reaction request to the description box below. We'll see you soon. Peace. Peace.